Hello everyone, Jake here. I'm going to show you today how to get to Windows 8. I mean, how to get to Safe Mode in Windows 8. Now, Safe Mode can be very good for diagnostics to see, like, if your computer isn't booting, you may get into Safe Mode and run some tests, maybe do a virus scan if it can't log in and it does all funny stuff if you've been done by ransomware. Or maybe you want to, I don't know, see what Safe Mode is. Now, you used to just press F8 and it would give you the boot options menu. This is in XP, Windows Vista, Windows 7. But now with Windows 8 you press F8 and nothing happens. It just boots like normal, either that or you'll just try to log in and it'll just get stuck if that's the reason you're trying to get into safe mode. But, so to actually get into it you need to boot to the advanced options menu. You use that by holding down shift and pressing F8 like just smash it flat out bang 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 as fast as you can and that's basically how you do it and then I'll show you how to do it anyway then you've got to go through a couple of options and reboot it and it'll boot to safe mode and if it doesn't boot to safe mode that means you've got something wrong basically if you can't boot to safe mode and you can't boot to normal mode you've got something wrong but also Windows 8 now also um, it runs automatic repairs so that's why it's not as easy to boot to safe mode because now it will just automatically run repairs and try and repair itself. So anyway, let's jump to it and I'll show you how to do it. So as your computer's turning on, hold down shift and press F8 repeatedly and then this menu will come up. So from this menu, you want to choose troubleshoot to open the troubleshooting options. Then go advanced options. Um, and then we want startup settings. And then when you hit restart, this will give you the options to either boot in safe mode or boot in whichever other mode you want or debugging mode or anything like that. So we'll just hit restart. Give it a second. So here you go. Now here are all your different options. You can press 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 or F1, F1, F2 and F10 will give you more options. But most of the time you want to start safe mode with networking. That's what I use anyway. And then I've just clicked that. Select safe mode with networking. And as you see, Windows is now booting. Just going to give it a sec. And there we go. Now we have the login screen. As you see, type in my password, log in. Give it a minute. It's always in safe mode. This stupid help and support thing comes up. Just exit it. But as you can see, safe mode. Every single corner says we're in safe mode. So that's how you boot into safe mode. Troubleshoot your computing problems. Anyway, don't forget to like and subscribe to see more from me and more videos going on. So have a good day. And um, comment if you want to see any new videos, any suggestions. Alright, see you later.